Okay, so we're up to our third segment for today's Taco Tuesday. Um, our third group to present today is Rittenhouse. Rittenhouse is a, a, a new uh, vendor partner. We're kind of in the process of finalizing our partnership, but we wanted to give them an opportunity to, uh, to speak to our members today. So I will probably, I think I'll be turning it uh, over to Gina, but Gina, maybe uh, you can you can tell me if uh, somebody else from the team will be speaking to us instead. Yes, hi. Um, I'm just trying to figure out how to turn my camera on. <laughs> hmm. Well, um, down at the bottom of the screen, uh, if you hover your mouse, oh, here we go. Button. Yes, I found it. Thank you. Okay, um, well, thank you so much for having us today. We're very excited to have a new partnership with um, all the members of the Wills organization. And um, so I'd like to just start and introduce myself. I am the territory manager for all the four-year academic libraries across the US. Um, so I'll be working with those members that are four-year academic libraries. And I am located in Sarasota, Florida. So I'm on the East Coast time. And um, I'd just like to take a moment to kind of introduce since Rittenhouse might be new to many of the members. And um, we are actually celebrating 75 years of history and what all began as a bookstore um, of health science and rare books in Philadelphia has now grown into one of the nation's largest distributors of scientific, technical, um, STM, medical content. And we are distributing uh, titles of over more than 500 leading publishers out there in the market um, to uh, healthcare providers, you know, universities, retailers, and libraries as well. And um, one of the other points of uh, Rittenhouse is that we have a market leading online platform. Um, our database is the R2 Digital Library, and that's what our focus is gonna uh, primarily be on with the move to a lot of electronic content but we provide access to all the essential health science content um, on our two library on an intuitive, you know, simple to use interface and that we'll share more on in the presentation and that will be with Rob Lennox. But I'm gonna turn it over now to uh, Ty Sweatman. Thank you, Gina. Yeah, I am the two-year academic library account manager for Rittenhouse. So I look forward to working with all of you. I am located near, uh, just north of Atlanta, Georgia. So I'm also on the Eastern time zone. Uh, there's my contact information. Feel free to reach out at any time. And I thought today I would just focus on one particular library service that we offer because I'm hearing there's gonna be more in-person learning this fall. So uh, the service is free. It's a core collection update plus uh, service. And it's really simple. You would just email us your, your shelf list and we would analyze that and show you any new additions or volumes to series that could update your current collection. So uh, just email Gina or I to get the ball rolling. We'll be happy to do that for you. We'll generate a report back to you. If you decide to purchase any of those resources to update your collection with Rittenhouse, you would do that on rittenhouse.com. And if you don't have a login for that, of course, we can get you set up with one. And uh, really, that's what I wanted to touch on uh, today. Uh, we also in the service, I, I forgot to mention, uh, we'll also show you what's available in your print collection, in your current pr print collection, what is available on R2. So you'll also get that analysis in this uh, free service. So uh, mentioning R2, uh, I'll turn it over to Rob Lennox, who's going to do a demonstration of R2. Hi, everybody. I'm Rob Lennox. I'm the R2 Digital Library Education and Support Manager. Uh, and I'll be running through a quick uh, review of the R2 Digital Library platform today. Just want to make sure that everybody is seeing um, the R2 Digital Library screen okay. Yep, we can see, we can see the, well, uh, we see a, uh, a PowerPoint slide right now. Is that, is that what you no, mean? So I, I need to click new share then, right? Okay. There we go. All right. How's that? Yes. Okay. Perfect. Okay. So just to start with a quick introduction. Uh, the R2 Digital Library is a health science ebook database from Rittenhouse Book Distributors, and it's been built with customized software specialized for health sciences information. The R2 Library provides quick access uh, to thousands of ebooks from the leading health science publishers on one interface. And currently, we have over 5,000 titles that you can choose from, from over 100 health science publishers. 
And there's going to be two ways that you can make uh, R2 eBooks available to your end users. One would simply be firm ordering those specific R2 titles of your choice. The second would be opening those titles on patron-driven acquisitions. Um, we have a mediated PDA model, so you're in full control of your purchases from your PDA triggers. Uh, but as a result, whether you're firm ordering your R2 titles or you're opening them up on patron-driven acquisition, selecting content on R2 is both transparent and flexible. Now, just to talk about our purchase model, uh, R2 eBooks are individually priced at the title level, okay? Uh, you're going to set the number of concurrent users you would like at the title level. So this enables you to build a database to meet your local need there. You pay once for the life of the edition. So there's no annual subscription for content. Now, here's where the uh, Will's incentive comes in with the R2 Digital Library. Typically, uh, we have an annual maintenance fee, uh, which is $1,200. Uh, that covers all additional features, functionality enhancements, collaboration tools, the hosting of archive content, mark records, and so forth. But we have reduced that annual maintenance fee for Will's members from $1,200 down to $400, and we are waiving it for the first year. Okay, so really nice savings there. In addition, um, we typically run uh, specials ongoing throughout the year. Uh, we'll be launching our Rights of Spring special so shortly on uh, April 19th through May 31st, and that will give you 22% off uh, an R2 title purchase of any size. So that'd be 22% off uh, line item R2 titles during those dates. So now I'm going to finally direct you to my screen here. This is uh, r2library.com. And I am going to log in with my username and password. Uh, this is the area that your end users will resolve to at the platform level. Most of the time, they're going to access R2 from a link of some sort. Um, as I mentioned earlier, the R2 library is a specialized database for health sciences content. So let me show you what that means to us. I'm gonna type in diabetes to the search box here. The system is now searching across all of the content in the database for diabetes. The platform is returns results at the section and chapter levels from all the different resources and publishers contained in the database. This result set will be unique um, as it's dynamic, dynamic based upon your institution's collection. And we know that US librarians are expert searchers, but in most cases, end users are not. So they're not going to want to scroll through over 75,000 search results for diabetes. So down the left hand side here, we've built in filters to help them quickly navigate the result set. So for example, I can come in and I can just choose the uh, to, to filter by the practice area of nursing. And then I could come down and I can choose uh, to filter by the discipline of care plans here. So up until this point, I have done nothing. And, and I want to point out that I've whittled down from over 70,000 down to 127 search results. Uh, up until this point, I've done nothing that has occupied a concurrent user license for any title on R2. But now that I have, uh, I'm going to drill into this chapter level search result, I'm using one concurrent user for this specific title. You'll notice that now that I'm within the title, I can search this title either through the search box or the table of contents. I've got a topics tab, and these are all index terms within the entire resource and then within the section. And then I've got the tools button. So this is where end users will really find this um, helpful. Um, we make it easy for end users to capture information in any section by being able to print it, email it, and export a citation for it. Saving bookmarks, saving references, and saving course links. These are hallmarks of R2. You can create a deep link uh, to a section of content or a chapter of content. And while all resource URLs on R2 are persistent, each section's deep link is also persistent for use in course management software, but can be shared in other forms such as social media, libguides, A to Z lists, et cetera. So as we take a closer look at the search results here, uh, you'll notice that index terms are hyperlinked. So for example, if I click on insulin, platform is going to rerun a search for me on that index term. And if I simply wanted to find images for insulin, I can click on images under the show results from section. 
I can then jump into a search result uh, where I can then find images. I can save images, I can large images, I can find a direct linked image. So these sorts of images can, used, can be used in something like a PowerPoint presentation. So that is really the um, end user experience uh, with the R2 Digital Library. Uh, we are offering 60 day extended trials into the R2 Library where you'll have access into uh, the platform, all of its features and functionality, but uh, in addition to uh, the 5,000 titles that we have available on the platform. Uh, we also do uh, provide educational and training webinars for the R2 Digital Library ongoing. I conduct them. Um, we do have a schedule that we can forward out to folks. Um, they are typically under 15 minutes on various topics, uh, our PDA model, for example, or how to buy or customization and so forth. So. Um, that is the R2 Digital Library. And if you would like um, to register for any of our reoccurring uh, educational webinars or to set up a 60-day trial, feel free to reach out to either uh, Ty or Gina. Uh, they would ha be happy to uh, set that up for you. So I'm going to jump back over here to the PowerPoint. Uh, and so thank you, everybody. I don't know if Gina or Ty has anything else to add, but uh, that's it for my piece. Thank you, everybody, for your time. I do appreciate it. Yeah, th thanks so much. We, we appreciate the time today. It was, it was a pleasure to be here. Yes, thank you very much. We look forward to working with uh, Will's. Well, thanks. Yes, we're we're really excited to be uh, moving ahead with a partnership with Rittenhouse as well. I think it's a really cool uh, service, really cool product. And I, I, I think that we're going to find a lot of our members are going to be interested in in adopting.